Hello folks, hello Slayers, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today we're reacting to episode 20. I'm no longer reacting to two episodes at a time, sorry. But I did make a poll on my other channel, Billy Carney Reacts. Shockingly, to me anyways, more people preferred one episode at a time opposed to two. Maybe because I said if I do one, I'll be able to post more frequently, which is true. Hopefully you guys over here feel the same way. Personally though, I would have liked to, but it really really cuts the workload in half and I could spend more time on other things that I'm working on or just other reactions and like just keep this thing moving a bit. Really wanted to wait to the end of the season to do it but once I did the one episode it's like I can't go back. So I don't really have much to recap from last episode. Brian's dad passed. Brian and Michael have been getting pretty handsy. I mean Brian has been getting handsy with Michael. Wonder where their relationship is gonna go. I hope we have no more Daphne and Justin. I mean, that's totally done, right? I felt very weird about that. All my friends being girls, like it's just, it was very weird. That would never happen. We're really teeing up to the end of the season. We have two more episodes after this. This episode is called King of Babylon. Don't know where that's going. Sounds like perhaps Babylon is gonna hold some type of contest of sorts, but yeah, only one way to find out. So let's get into it. Can you believe it's been a whole year already? Well, since what? King of Babylon. Uh, it always seems like such a big deal at the time, and then like a week later, you can't even remember who won. Angel Escobar. <laughs> wow, you were paying attention. Ted, I was Oh, shit. That was amateur. Oh, I forgot to mention them. After their editing, I feel like I'm a bit more intrigued about them. I do want Ted to be happy. I can see them being cute, I guess. I'm just very not into how it went down, of course. God, who would do that? Who wouldn't? Brian. No. I mean, strip in front of all those people. For a thousand bucks and a trip to the Bahamas? A lot of guys. Especially when you're on drugs. Please, you'll do anything. <laughs> Oops, sorry. Blake acknowledges his addiction and he's working on it. Going to meetings at the Gay and Lesbian Center. My, aren't we a busy little bee? Well, I mean, from Babylon? Well, I don't think David's gonna wanna go. It's kinda late. Does he already have his teeth in a glass by then? How do you know he gets up at 6 o'clock every morning and runs five miles while you're still in bed? I'm sure he would go if I wanted him to. Uh-huh. Then make sure he's there. I will. Okay. Babylon isn't exactly a drug-free environment. Blake's a big boy. Why don't you let him decide? I'm fine. Really? We're in? Hooray! Okay. Oh, wait, it's couples night. Seems I'm the only single boy left. What the fuck do you think I am? Are we going to Babylon? <laughs> those jeans are all torn and too tight. I feel so judged now those... for liking David. <laughs> How come I haven't I seen you in them before? Kind of I only. Oh my God, I totally forgot for a second what he did. I don't think I could get back with someone that did that. Nor could I believe that he doesn't do anything just the looks. That was so weird. Tonight's the King of Babylon contest. Oh, Michael, I'm too old for that. Shit. No, you're not. If the guy saw how incredibly sexy you look in those jeans, they'd probably stop, um... What? Never mind, I shouldn't have said anything. No, no, no. Finish what you were gonna say. I bet they'd stop making jokes about adult diapers and penile implants. He really doesn't ever go. Penile right? implant. You said it yourself. You're too old. He looks f***ing amazing. So, I don't know. I knew they wouldn't come. Hey, boys. Sorry we were late. Wow. You, the... Great. <laughs> Woo! Okay, enough of this. Happy David's here. Is this the King Knight now? Yeah. Hey, dude. The filming is so cool. I have been around. I've been away. Need a favor? No thanks. Who's that? My dealer. Ex-dealer. I'm okay. Trust me, okay? I do. Let's dance. Kinda hard to trust when can or does he even trust himself. Gentlemen and gentlemen, most of the evening. I wish there was lesbians here, too. We Downtown, where the freaks are coming around, there's a whole oh, lot. Welcome to the King of Babylon! I was gonna say, I can't believe this show isn't rebooted, but it was, and it was done horribly. Creators of this show should bring it back. Like, this could be like Trixie Montel right now. So how about the real thing? Check back with me in an hour. What? So now I'm a backup plan? Who you do when all else fails? We're not a couple. Michael and David are a couple. So what are we, Brian? I don't know about you, but I'm single. Poor Justin. Your son Jonathan is waiting for you. Who is that? Vic, oh my god. Hey, hello. Where are we? Uh-oh. Okay. Little hokey pokey. So. Stop. 
What are you into? A little shopping, dinner, a movie, a new Julia Roberts. I just love her. Same. Want to do something? I'm sorry, but public restrooms aren't my scene. Then how about we go someplace else? This is so random. Put a mirror for it. The music's so loud in here, you can barely hear yourself think. Oh, that's better. I don't know why I insist on coming here. It's always the same. Love the... Ooh. Yes. This is great. This is fantastic. Gentlemen and gentlemen, contestant number one. Whoever hates on this show is such a loser. Very arresting, don't you think? And until we break free of our stunted adolescence and our superficial values, we'll always be boys, never men. God, is that all? So why don't you sign up? Because I don't need to dance around in my underwear to get laid. You can't handle the competition. <laughs> Please sign up. So easy to get under his skin, I love it. Oh my god, he's gonna sign up. No way. He is. Babe. He is. Our and next contestant win. is Mohammed. Oh! Wait, so he's gonna do this? Okay. Mm, what's with the long face, sweetheart? Nothing. This guy. <laughs> Ain't it always. I knew he was gonna say that. So what did this guy do? He takes me for granted. A walking wet dream like you could have anyone he wants. I know, part I find so irritating. Maybe he needs Vibes. to know it. True. This is what I'm saying, like, we... Maybe everybody needs to know it. Ooh. Hey, Deb, telephone. It's the oh, publisher's house. New. Tell him I won the sweepstakes last year. It's your brother. Oh, what's up, honey? I love her. Don't panic. <gasps> I've been arrested. What? I said, don't panic. All right. And don't tell anybody. What happened? I was at the mall. But well, what are they charging you with? Not flushing? Public. Indecent exposure. What in the hell did you do? Why get it, somebody? I didn't do anything, sis, I swear. Can you come down? I'm leaving right now, all right? Did you bring my meds? I should have taken them an hour ago. Mm, yeah, don't worry. I hate this. Don't worry about anything. If something happens it. to Vic it's one day, I'm really going to lose that. All our lives. They're exactly. like, their brother and sister dynamic gets to me on a personal level. And I just, I feel like it's me and my sister in the future, and I just love it. I love them. Two halves of the same soul that have finally I met. hope this isn't like it's a fucking fling. Forward of me, hardly know each other, but would you mind? That is very much if I go right ahead. Wow, my sister just texted me. <laughs> Emmett is giving brain. <laughs> I'm trying to not get demonetized. He's doing a fucking amazing job. Oh. oh. Uh, and also, someone next to them is getting their salad toss. Me and Emin, I think, have the same specialty. Was that all right, my love? It was like Christmas, New Year's, and my birthday all rolled up into one. Not the 4th of July? I'm saving that for you. Nope. Okay, now getting the favor in return. Oh. Something you all better get. I'll be right back. Where are you going? Bathroom. Oh god, like, let's be serious. You think it's a good idea to let him go alone? Absolutely not. Would you like me to hold it for him? <laughs> yeah. No, I mean after what happened last time. It's called trust. It's called delusion. Maybe he won't. Maybe he'll disappoint all of you and actually be all right. When you were a boy, did you save the birds with the broken wings? What did you do, tear them off? <laughs> Everybody, I That's want you to meet a, a very killer. special someone. What's his name? Oh, does he even know? I'm Brent. Brent. Hi, Brent. Hi. Hi, Brent. Hello. Welcome. Special to Emmett is special to us. Who? Oh, Emmett. my God. That's me. I can't tell song. if this is giving one episode or more. It's somewhere out there. Kind of think more. Uncanny. Well, come and have a drink with us. Hey, what's up? What's the problem? You know what his problem is. Come on. Emmett knows some guy for all of 15 minutes. He's practically a frat brother. Blake, he can barely speak to. Well, maybe that's because I he don't left know you for what to dead. say. So you nearly killed my friend. Hey, I hear you passed out on the bathroom floor. You want to be buds? Figured if anyone could have given him a chance, it would have been you, Michael. 
Uh, I kind of feel bad for that. Hold on, Jesus! Fixing jail. Oh, anything. cause she's like a lawyer. But he needs a lawyer and I didn't know no, what it's I... okay. I'm gonna go get dressed. Well, if he didn't do anything, why did they arrest oh, him? It, it, harassment of gay people. Cops just like playing capture the fag. And you think Vic did something? I was just asking. Yeah, well, I'm telling you, I know my own brother. Of course he it's did crack. something. Yeah. Said he'd check back with you in an hour. You still have eight minutes left. He has zits on his ass. Uh-huh. She was looking at Justin. Well, if I were you, I wouldn't wait too long. By then, I may have other plans. Yeah. As if he gives us so signal. You. Who's your uh, friend? Get out of here. I'm not interested in any of your favors. Great do stuff. Do drug dealers really do this to people? Great price. <laughs> Did you come to check up on me? Of course so not. What if you did? You just seem to meet the cutest guys here. Cause I told you I'm fine. All right, I tried to like Blake, but you're annoying me. And he comes out of the bathroom. I know. Ted come is on, doing uh, too much. Ted, you're honest. amazing. It's not. You don't need this. I'd rather just be with you. I've always dreamt about living in a little cottage with a garden out back, where, where I can grow. I'll be right back. Don't go away. I'll be waiting. Where are you right going? Here. I don't trust any of these men. Like, I'm ready to go whenever you are. You can't leave yet. You'll miss my big number. Like you'd really I go through with it. Can't wait well, to see this. Now, he you can't leave. Now. Our next contestant likes younger men. His special skill is manipulating people. Must be you. Pittsburgh's hunkiest chiropractor, Dr. Uh, David Cameron. Brian put him down. You asshole. I'm here for Dr. it. Dr. I thought you were signing up yourself. Now why would I want to do that? So he is going to you don't have it. to go up Dr. there. Cameron. You have no intention of it. You wouldn't want to make a fool of yourself dancing around in your underwear at your age. Dr. Don't worry Cameron. about it, Doc. It was just a joke. Well, you think I can't do it at my age? Paging Dr. Cameron! Get the fuck up there. Show them who the real daddy is. Yeah. He's so hot. I mean, come on. Yes. Michael should be having fun with us. Killing it. Yes, he is. Oh. <laughs> oh. Hey. Get those trousers off, boy. Don't be a sister. No. Not this gloom. Excuse me, Sergeant. Uh, sorry, ladies. You have to come back later. He's still being processed. But I'm his sister. Can you just tell me how much his bail is set at? Five thousand. What? Five thousand dollars. Isn't that high for a first offense? It says here he's got a previous arrest. For what? Possession of an illegal substance. All right. Um, Brian has the money. He was pulled over. It was ten years ago. There was a joint in the glove compartment. It wasn't even his. My brother's very sick. He's got to take his meds. He's HIV positive. Oh, figures. Excuse me? Uh, no drugs allowed in the holding cell until the precinct doctors examine him. But these are prescription medications. Come on. I'm stressed. You did so amazing, cute. Sweetie. You have great abs. Call me. Yeah. Please. Anytime. He's already taken. Well, I suppose you're pleased with yourself. Put your shirt on. I don't want to hear another word about it. Come here. This feeling is the worst feeling in the world. First hand experience. Yes, please do it. But then don't go to him. The next contestant loves the Powerpuff Girls, margaritas, and older men who take it for granted. Here's Justin! 
I'm so happy for him. Yes, Justin. I feel bad though. Brittany is shaking. I feel bad because what he feels he has to do to get Brian's attention. Where were you? Is that cologne? Huh? I guess so. Disgusting. Next, crossing his name out. Is everything all right? You <sighs> seem a little distant. Everything's fine. Okay. I can't lie to you. We've met too much to each other for that. I've met someone new. New? Oh We've only God. been together an hour and 45 minutes. I didn't mean for it to happen, I swear. I never meant to hurt you. <laughs> you do this to me? To us? After all that we shared? Please, this don't make me. this harder than it has I'm to be. I'm so triggered by you this whole episode. You that you never felt so close to anyone in your whole life. Things change. I still love you. Passion dies. You have to accept it and move on. Fine. Go! Then let him go. On. Who's stopping you? Why were you chasing him, idiot? I'll remember you. Always. Yeah, how long is that? Till tomorrow? <sighs> we need someone for Emmethon because this isn't okay. My sister is a diabetic. She got it when she was about 10. So how's she doing? They cut her leg off a few years ago. Now she's losing her sight. God bless her. I imagine you'd swim the English Channel to be there for her, huh? Actually, we don't see much of each other. We never got along. Now, do you mind? I'm trying to work here. It's a few pills. It's a few fucking pills. How the hell are we gonna get five thousand dollars? We have a winner for the new king of Babylon, Justin. Yeah. This is exactly what I wanted, but now that I got it, like, yes, silly boy. taking you for granted anymore. Thanks. Did you see me? Yeah, I saw you. Well, I think that contest was rigged. You know him? Yeah. I taught him everything he knows. Except how to dance. What's your name? I'd ask him only. I'm sure he doesn't know. Sean. You're hot. I was watching you. You were. It made me want to fuck all night. Guys, this is just what I was saying. He needs to get Brian jealous. But real talk, this is sad. <laughs> Let's just give in to the fantasy, right? I don't know if I can, but I'm gonna try. You wanna get out of here? You leave. Thought we had plans. If you couldn't do better, I told you I might have plans too. What's this problem? He's just my stalker. I suppose we could have a three-way. No. Only, he's kinda old. We're also kinda leaving. Throwing himself all over you. Excuse me. Huh? Are you the person who said about an hour ago wanted to go home? I'm going home. Michael. Go after him. Is there some sort of problem on account of me? Of course not. I don't want to come between you and your friends. You're not. Even if you were, it wouldn't matter. If a friend of mine has a problem with you, all it means he was never really my friend to begin with. My pen scented. Is Justin just in the sex room? I wonder if this is gonna be like. Is that Justin topping? Yes. 
Uh, this is all too much. This is everything I said in the like last episode, but wow, they really gave it to us. This is what I was saying. Like he needs this to happen to realize, right? Oh, this is all working out. Mom, Melly, oh, what are you doing? Thing. Where's Brian? David has the money. I, I was hoping maybe you uh, could help. Okay, right. He does do. Well, I would, Debbie, but I can't really open a bank on a Saturday night. Okay. Maybe credit card? I can cover it. Can you take a check? Only if it's certified. Shit! Any more f***ing difficult? Okay, you know what? We're gonna have to call a bail bond. If you call this number, mention this guy's name, he'll put up the bail for you. What was okay. that all about? I asked Dino for a favor. All right. Thank you. Blake. Blake. Blake, I'm Debbie. <laughs> oh, some friend you got. <laughs> yeah, I like to think so. Oh, thank you. Where'd you find him? <laughs> well, right here. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. No problem. Sorry if I've been Annoying. shitty. It's because you care about Ted. So do I. Did I miss something? No. What? No. We're all set. Let's go. There's nothing to be ashamed of. We know you're innocent. I just want to go home. Can we please go home? This will take you home right now. I'm trying to get your meds to you all night. It's all right. The desk sergeant gave me my pills. Let's go. He was still an asshole, but there's something going on there. Are we going to meet again? Let him feel Everyone himself. Everyone how hot like you that. are, even at your age. I suppose you're going to be out partying every night. Not every night. But it was nice to get the attention to know I'm still attractive. See, before you hang these jeans up until next laundry day, how about doing a little dance for me? Let's do a ball. That's it. Uh, I need to get laid. <sighs> this coffee's for shit. Rude. So Justin's the new king of Babylon. So oh, iconic. So why don't you pass the f***ing sugar? You should be proud of it. Like father, like son. <laughs> hey, isn't that Brent? Oh. I already Spread. crossed his name out. Emmett's old flame. Emmett's <laughs> old flame. Must be his new love. What's gonna happen? Where are you going? Are they gonna have a throuple? In a long time. I've thought of you often. You look good. You too. You seeing anyone? Not really. You? We just met. So you'll be free tonight? Probably. Would you? And we can't go back. I prefer to remember the way we were. Slayer. Hail to the king. What a night. So how was he? He had the greatest ass. I brought him back. I fucked him all night. <laughs> My dick's gonna be sore for a week. That's enough. I'd like to hear more. Speak slowly and enunciate. Gave great head. He wanted me to fuck him with my crown on. <laughs> it's kind of kinky. <laughs> After a while, though, he got really clingy. He wanted to know when he could see me again. So what'd you tell him? I told him that he could see me in his dreams. Oh my god, that's what he said, right? It is. Yeah. So, <laughs> who's up for the absolute apps contest? Big, thick, muscle. Big, thick, muscle. So, so cool. Uh, he's fucking someone else already? you so that is it for this episode that was so fun so stressful we didn't get into detail with the vic thing but we as the audience know right or could highly assume that vic did do something i think we're gonna circle jerk it back at some point and like that'll come up again somehow i don't know yeah so i mean i just saw the picture of the next episode so Michael is having sex with someone, but he's definitely got a taste of his own medicine. Literally, basically getting his lines used to him. Brian's face, love it. It's everything I've been waiting for. Happy David showed them all who's daddy. And yeah, I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. I'll see you in the next one. It's Billy Bitch.